Hello everyone, how are you well? This is Coins Kid. I'm just going to dive into XRP. Once again, thank you for your support. Really do appreciate it. So the Telegram's blowing up, the Patreon's blowing up, the Discord's blowing up, the Twitter's blowing It's all blowing up. And Cardano's blowing up as well, isn't it? But uh, Cardano's in prices. We do check the Cardano video out. But right now, XRP is picked up relatively nicely off that low down there it was a previous swing high uh, which we have been targeting we will dive in in a moment but so far you know so good the dxy is quite worrying but uh, a lot of people yesterday they did say that the dxy is in a bearish pattern which is good you know you, we want to see them bearish patterns on a dxy because there is an inverse correlation between that as you, i outlined in yesterday's video so we will keep an eye on the dxy it has broken out you know we do need to pay attention to it because if it does go up and shoots off into space then you know it is inversely correlated with crypto at the minute until we can find that inverse correlation broken that is what it is unfortunately okay so we do need to pay attention to it moving forward but hopefully it hits a level of resistance and continues in the downtrend okay so we will keep an eye on that but so far you know xrp is holding support relatively well and it's looking for continuation and just like i said to you potentially you form some kind of little handle here this is exactly what we're doing you know and you've got this lovely little cup and handle pattern that's just formed here for xrp you come up you form a beautiful little handle come back to support like I said to you, you refer to the videos at this point everyone's going to shit themselves thinking you're entering a bear market okay but right now you've come back up and if you break this high here you've got a technical target off this cup and handle so I'm going to draw this in for you um, uh, you've met that resistance haven't you you know what we were down here we were down here I said you're going to come up and hit levels of resistance and, you, and that's what you do and as long as you fall back to support you're looking at continuation and so far so good isn't it you know you've come up at this resistance fell back carried on you know resistance fell back carried on resistance fell back carried on you've not quite hit the daily 20 but you can see it's in a mo looking a lot more healthier now this on the daily because this was taken off and your EMAs were left behind and this will say to you we're always well back and hold them as support for continuation so right now XRP is having a lovely little push up and it's breaking this level of resistance of this handle so you're coming up to test this high because if you do break this high I'll tell you what that high is right now if you do start to see XRP come up and break this local high you've got loads of little targets here okay so you've effectively got this cup and handle target just there so you break this high like that you know you're looking at a beautiful little pump here you know this is your technical target off this cup and handle you could be looking at a, a new local high here of 219 okay and that would actually tie up with our impulsive wave which we are actually going through right now for, for uh, xrp where we've actually come down we start to retrace back up to this local high and you can see we've ran into the, the level of resistance here which is this former resistance over there and that's where we roll back to the 050 almost we didn't quite come down to it to be honest with you but we are holding support and we're back up to the 0618 here now if we do come up and we break this level of resistance you're in a technical target of two dollars 19 for xrp uh two dollars yeah two dollars 16 round about that area i'm a little bit off with that it's round about there the cup and handle pattern that we're forming right now okay but equally you've got a little bull flag here okay which you've broken out of some from there to there you know you've come back a little bull flag like that and you've broken a level of resistance so you're in another technical target of this break bringing you up to 153 which i do believe if we take a quick look at that right now i do believe that is actually a uh impulsive wave up to the upside as well i think we laid down that target yesterday didn't we so from there to there and you can pretty much see yeah it's at 158 which is a technical target that of the uh fibonacci extension right here okay so that's your technical target of the cup and handle which you break if you break this high at 137 okay which you know you are impulsively moving up right now you, you you're already above a 0618 you see this is impulsive let me move to the four hourly time frame so you can see it's a bit messy i do apologize so yeah effectively you've come back to a key level support and right now you are breaking out of that support and, and a resistance above and you are carrying out an extension here provided Providing you can move on and break these levels of resistance, you're looking at a brand new impulsive wave here for XRP, bringing you back up to break this 135. Now, if you break 135, you've got a beautiful little long here of around about 17% because that's the technical target, the 1618 at $1.58 for, for um, XRP. And you can see it's pretty much the, the, what the bull flag is, look, because you've come up like this from this level of consolidation. You came back in a, in a mini little bull flag, okay, and you broke out, you come up and you formed another little bull flag back to a level of support which is a previous swing high do you see that a little bit down below that but you did find support just there and that's where you've broken up and you're now breaking resistance now if you continue to break this resistance and turn it into support you are looking at a fib 
up here at 158 okay which is also equally the bull flag target of roughly 152 so you can see it's pretty much on its way but to to validate this you've got to see this high broken okay if you see that high broken you're looking at a beautiful little pump up to 156 where again i think you might get a little bit of extended and start to fall back and potentially you know fall back onto this swing high as you have done here you're moving up like cardano cardano's doing exactly the same thing you know when you move up you want to rest on swing highs swing lows to swing highs support 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 for continuation if you stop rolling and losing these swing highs that's negative for xrp and you know you come up here and you roll again that's negative for xrp but you're not completely out of the woods okay this is what i say to you don't trade now you know people jump in oh and then it falls down and it's a bit of a fake out and it rolls and it loses its eye and it comes down even lower you know and, uh, and all the all the the, the 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 basically fomo people have fomoed in always break for the wait for the break of these highs okay wait for the break of this eye because that's a confirmation statement that you're breaking this eye and you're looking at a technical target of the fibs really is that easy okay so that's xrp stay healthy stay strong you held support like a boss on the uh, uh four hourly time frame here i think i did say to you you know it is looking for a, a four hourly 55 ema test just like this one you got overextended you're coming back you're looking for a four hourly 55 ema test and just there it went up got overextended and look it's found support on the four hourly 55 ema like a boss so yeah you're holding it just like you did here and you're now starting to move onwards and upwards again you know it's looking good it's looking good the dxy is concerning do keep an eye on that you know i don't want to put people off but there is an inverse correlation so we do need to pay attention to that is it a case of you know we, we are going to surge with the dxy this is a theory as well we were are going to surge with the dxy potentially just take off into space get to our targets before we do enter the bear you know where the dxy continues with its trend who knows but do keep an eye on that dxy and, and thank you once again for your really nice comments of support that, that i've been getting across the channel so again a, a, an entry point just there you know if you do start to fall back to support right now four hour four hourly four hour four hourly you're above the 20 so if you do start to see a little roll put some cheeky bids on the 20 because you're now in uptrend you're holding it support and you continue to do so you're going to come up break this eye you're looking at a beautiful continuation because if you can get lucky and get a little cheeky bid on that 20 if you do fall back to it you're looking at a lovely little long up of around about 34 percent there for for xrp okay but equally you know the responsible thing and not financial advice is wait for the break of this eye okay and equally set stop set stop losses okay set stop losses always set stop losses because you get throwbacks and you come back and retest support pretty much what like it, it has done i think it broken out and it come back to a key level support before it actually come up and met that technical target of one two one i think it was off a w bottom or whatever it was i can't remember right now but yeah it's it's doing well take care everyone back soon with another xrp update stay healthy stay strong stay tuned and thank you for your support across the channel Bye bye